February 17th. Undercover observations from Miss Finster, tape 93. So what do you think, Sam? Should we dig in tunnel 32A or maybe take a nice burrow down 14C? I don't know, Dave. Last time we... x -nay, and already. <clears throat> so then, like, Hillary goes, really? And then, like, I go, as if, and she's all totally not even. Uh, actually, A. Ew, it's Randall. Get out of here, you little snitch. Loser! <gasps> Mr. Girly to you, and then let him have it. Pow! <laughs> <laughs> hey, look what I found. A spy, and he's wired for sound. Hey! Ah! Scram, you little monkey booger! What have you got for me today, Randall? Well, uh, Hector Gecko made himself throw up to get out of his spelling quiz, and, uh, I saw Shirley Benson spit on Principal Prickly's car. That's it? I expected more from you, Randall. Perhaps you've lost your touch. No, Miss Spencer, it's just that... I like you, Randall, but I can't afford any dead weight in my organization. Maybe we should talk about your retirement. No, not that! Please, Miss Spencer, give me one more chance! Young Douglas over there shows potential. I can do better, I know I can. Give me another chance and I'll dig up some real dirt. Well, if it means that much to you... I'll give you one more chance. But this time, you better not let me down. <sighs> Let's see. Pee Wee Ritano has webbed toes. Kenny Saperstein is a bedwetter. Spinelli? No, it can't be! This is way too good for Finster. Why, with dirt like this, I could, dare I say it, rule the playground! <laughs> Warm breath. What do you got, crayons in your ears? Get to the end of the line before I show you the end of my fist. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Spinelli. We wouldn't want everyone knowing your little secret, would we? Get out of here, you little... I know your name, Spinelli. Your first name. <laughs> Sorry I messed up your shirt there, Randall. Did I say it was a nice shirt? Nice try, Spinelli, but it's not gonna work. Come on, Randall, old buddy, old pal. You don't have to tell anybody. Why shouldn't I? You've never done anything for me. I'll do whatever you want. Just please don't tell anyone my name, please. Well, if it means that much to you, there is a thing or two you could do. Anything. Name it. My homework every night for the rest of the year. Agreed. Also, from now on, you must refer to me as His Supreme Most Honorable Lord Randall. What? Okay, done. Which brings us to items 3 through 27. 27? Oh! Oh, get you for this, Ashley Spinelli! Oh, Spinelli? An Ashley? I don't believe it. Don't listen to him. He's lying. Oh, yeah? Well, explain this! <laughs> that bad. I mean, we're not a Spinelli by any other name. Punch is hard? Mikey's right. After all, it's just a name. Ashley isn't just a name, it's a curse. Well, perhaps that you hate it so much, you should have it changed. I can't do that. I was named after my great-aunt Ashley, the first woman to win the Iditarod. I never met her, but she's a family hero. Besides, it's not that I hate the name Ashley. It's just that, well, for as long as I can remember, every other girl named Ashley's always been one of them. Snotty Prissy and a member of their stupid Snotty Prissy club. So? So, now that everybody knows my name, I'm going to have to join their stupid club and wear makeup and play dollies and drink tea. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, nothing. It's just the Ashleys wouldn't let you join their club if you pay them a million bucks. <laughs> yeah, the Ashleys hate your guts. Aw, oh, guys, that's the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. Yeah, what am I so worried about? They can't do anything to me, right? This is like a major tragedy. That creature, an Ashley, how could it be? I mean, just look at her hair. She doesn't even mince. All these years of primping and blow-drying the Ashley name to perfection, and now this? It's a disgrace. Girls, we have to do something. Like what, Ashley, eh? I'm afraid our only choice is to make Spinelli into one of us. Ew! What choice do we have, Ashley's? I mean, if we let her go around being her crude, disgusting Spinelli self, the name Ashley will be ruined forever. No longer will it stand for beauty and specialness. Soon, other girls will be considered cooler than us. And if we're not careful, by the time we're in junior high, our first dates will be with guys named Paul or Joe. Oh! Ashley's, we have no choice. We must make Spinelli into one of us. It's like the only way. What do you want? 
I, Ashley A, invite you, Ashley S, to be our new sister. <laughs> yeah, right. Send in the clowns, Powder Puff. Actually, Ashley S, you don't, like, have a choice. Like what? According to the Constitution of the Playground, Rule 5, Article 3, under clicks, and I quote, any kid named Ashley must become a member of the Ashleys if invited by another Ashley. But that can't be right. I'm afraid it is, Spinelli. It's an obscure, rarely used rule, but it's here. So I guess it's like official. You're one of us. One of us! One of us! No, you'll never take me alive! Here we go! Let me go! Let me go! Come on, Ashley S. You'll just love our clubhouse. No, no. Boy, talk about peer pressure. This is your clubhouse? <laughs> As if. This is our clubhouse. It's remarkable what one can do with a few accessories. <gasps> wow, this is amazing. This is... Hey, what's going on? Why are you looking at me that way? Don't worry, Ashley S. It's a good thing. Stop! No! No! We gotta do something, you guys. We just gotta. I don't know, Teach. I've been studying the Constitution from top to bottom, and the only way a kid could get out of a clique is if all the other kids in the clique felt about unanimously. I guess if your name's Ashley, you're one of them no matter what. Wait, that's it. Spinelli's not willing to change your name, right? Yeah. Well, I got just the thing. Library cards, social security cards, whatever you want. <laughs> Ashley S. Why, before you know it, you'll be blow drying and moosing just like the rest of us. <laughs> I love it when she's like this. Pardon me? I'm here for the meeting? <sighs> Hello, it's Ashley's only. <laughs> like a duh. Exactly. That's why I'm here. Ashley Grumler? But your name's not Ashley. Big as no. See? I've got my social security card, my school ID. What? But it can't be. Don't worry, Ashley Q. She still needs to be invited to join. And which one of us Ashleys is going to do that? Well, perhaps Ashley S would be so kind. No, listen, Gretchen. You don't want... Yeah, sure. No problem. <clears throat> I, Ashley S, invite you, Ashley G, to be our new sister. Thanks, but I'll... I mean, Ashley S. But... Whoa, Spiffy Diggs. What are you doing here? Ashley Duttweiler? You're an Ashley? That's right. Don't forget about us. Our names are all Ashley, too. It's official. But, but you're not even girls. Hey, it's the 90s. I, Ashley S, invite you, Ashley, 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 and Ashley, into our club. Yay! Oops, I almost forgot. <laughs> And you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you. They're destroying our clubhouse! What are we gonna do? I know, we'll kick them out. Sorry, but it takes you to best folk. And we kinda like it here. But, but... Of course, there is one way you can get us to leave. Anything! Name it! You let her out, and we'll go too. <sighs> I hate it when I don't get my way. Welcome back, Spinelli. Thanks. I thought I was a goner, but I should have known. As long as the kids got friends like you guys, it doesn't matter what your name is. <laughs> hey, Ashley S., where's your dolly? <laughs> I'll give you to the count of ten. One, two... <laughs> ten! Come back here, you little worm! There's a lot of Ashleys out there, but there's only one Spinelli. <laughs> 